Choctaw Nation employee has been appointed to a Treasury Committee in the federal government. He also happens to be mayor of Durant. Big deal here. News 12's Hannah Gonzalez spoke with him about what this will mean for tribes all across the country. Martin Tucker is the chief financial officer for the Choctaw Nation and also the mayor of Durant. Last month, he added a new title to his name that allows him to represent tribes across the nation. I've just recently been appointed to the Treasury's Tribal Advisory Committee. He is the first Choctaw tribal member to be a part of this committee, which will advise the Secretary of the Treasury. About uh, taxation that affects Indian country. Tucker believes the Choctaw Nation deserves a seat at the table. Many of the other tribes who, who, who deal with these same issues that we deal with are much smaller tribes and perhaps don't have the same level of organization, the same level of maturity as the Choctaw Nation has. A nation that was removed from their homeland. We were the first tribe on the Trail of Tears removed to what was then called Indian country because it wasn't even a state at that time. So that perspective, I think, is valuable for the Treasury to take into consideration as well when they're, when they're making these rules. And he's ready to get to work. We just want the same treatment that states and other sovereign entities within the country receive, and we believe that that's something that the Treasury needs to help us with. Martin will hold this role for the next four years, where he will serve with six other tribal leaders. In Durant, Hannah Gonzalez, News 12.